Hi everyone, this is Laura Mickelson, One Healthy Yogini. That kind of has become my hashtag because I try to eat healthy. Trust me, I am not perfect. I have been known to eat burgers and fries and chicken fingers and just lots of unhealthy things. However, nobody's perfect and in today's society we're bombarded with so much uh, refined processed foods. It's hard to get away from it. and sometimes time gets away from us and having the ability to take the time to create healthy is sometimes difficult and challenging. Anyway, I try to be healthy. So I'm a yoga teacher. I have been teaching yoga now for about 10 years. I have had my 200 hour certification for about seven years. And uh, additionally, I've had a 300 hour certification with yoga therapeutics as a focus. I really like to help people with you know, overcoming injuries, dealing with uh, structural issues in the body, pain in the body, and trying to understand why, and trying to find yoga poses that can help to ease the pain in the body. So I just wanted to welcome you because I've never done anything like this before. So, um, but I want to be able to share yoga with people, not that I just know personally, not just people that I teach in studios locally, but you know anyone out there who has issues, anyone who's ever wondered about why would I ever want to do yoga? What can yoga do for me? And you know, so to experience it, the best way to do it is just to get exposure to some good yoga. There's a lot of yoga out there. There's a lot of different styles and everybody finds a different style that's good for them. My style tends to be very alignment based to try to understand why the body feels the way it does within certain poses, how to adjust to make poses feel better, how to make poses work in the way that they're supposed to, stretching certain areas, lengthening certain areas, strengthening certain areas, creating more flexibility, balance, and strength. That's kind of my mantra flexibility, balance, and strength. And the big major bonus is that you often have this sense of stress relief at the end of a yoga class. We always end with a shavasana, an opportunity to just rest. Our society is so caught up in hurry, 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 doing more is better, being inundated with technology, with sounds and people and go, go, go. There's so important that we give ourselves the time to relax and let ourselves know that it is okay. It's not even, it's not just okay that we get relaxation. It is absolutely instrumental, absolutely key that we give ourselves the relaxation that we need. So even if it's only for a moment, for one minute of sitting and breathing. It's so important. If we go all the time, we're going to burn out. We need to give ourselves an opportunity to release stress. So yoga, it's for everyone. Now, everyone might find that in their, for their personality is not for them, but it can be for everyone. All ages, all stages, all sizes, um, male, female, no matter what your background is, yoga can be for you. Yoga can make you stronger, more intentional. And the thing that I found when I started doing yoga is that it wasn't just about exercise. That's really why I started doing yoga, was about exercise, find a form of exercise that gave uh, less stress in the joints. I taught group exercise for 25 years off and on. You know, I did the uh, uh, step aerobics, floor aerobics, jazzercise, tie bow, cardio kick. You know, I taught all of that. Um, we did body sculpting with weights. You know, I have taught a lot of different classes. Uh, I have very much been into health and fitness all of my life. And I find that the more and more I do it, the more and more I want to do it, the more I find that I want to find healthier ways to be a better me. And I want to share that with everyone out there. I want everyone to be able to find a way to find something that they enjoy doing, the foods that they enjoy eating that make them healthier, make their families healthier. So welcome to Yoga with Laura.
yoga with one healthy yogini. So I'm going to try to post at least um, one 30 minute video every week. And these yoga posts will be real basic style yoga. So that if you're coming to yoga for the first time, this is a great way to get experience, to see the poses, to have these poses described. Since I can't be with, be there with you in person and actually help and adjust you, I will try to describe the poses so that you can understand the feeling in your body, what you should be feeling in each pose. And hopefully this will be something that you'll want to do more of, not just here with me, but you'll find a local studio. You'll find a person that you can do yoga with and make it a part of your healthy, healthy lifestyle. So welcome, and I look forward to seeing you soon for our first.